Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, it's been a hot minute since I've been on here, so I thought I'd hop on quick and share some little updates with you guys. Um, I hope you guys had an awesome Christmas um, and a good holiday season. Um, I had a good Christmas, but I'm really missing Christmas time already. Um, unfortunately, I put my tree down too early this year, and I'm regretting it now because I miss looking over at the tree. But yeah, anyways. Um, I am having a huge sale in my shop now in my Silky Seduction shop on Etsy for you guys following along. Um, so I'm just going to jump right in and show you guys what I have on sale right now. Um, I have multiple soaps on sale in my shop. I'm just trying to kind of clear out inventory, make room for the new. I have a lot of new products coming to my shop. Um, these soaps aren't expired. Um, some have some small imperfections, which I'll show you here in a second and then I'm going to go ahead and show you my some of my new stuff that's coming so here we go so some of the new soaps in my shop or not new soaps but soaps that are on sale I'd say there's at least five soaps on sale right now that are kind of um, clearanced so the first one that you'll see on clearance is the flower market soap this is one of the most colorful soaps I have in my shop. And honestly, you guys, if you have not tried this one, go grab it now. It's not going to get any cheaper. This smells amazing. This is perfect for springtime coming up. Um, unfortunately, this one is one of my slower sellers for some reason, and I'm not sure why. Maybe some people don't like floral fragrances. Um, and also, this one has some imperfections on it. For instance, this one has kind of a hole on the side. Some of my other bars have kind of holes throughout, like two or three on a bar at the most. So that's not going to like affect how the bar works. These work amazing. You're going to feel that silky lather. Um, so yeah, go grab these. They, there are not many left. I did not make many of this one, but I am sad to see this one go. Mm. I know the couple people that did buy it continue to buy it, but I just want it off my shelves to have more space for my new fragrances, if that makes any sense. Another one is my Japanese Cherry Blossom. This one smells really good. Um, and again, there's some indentations on the side of this bar, and some of these are smaller for some reason. You guys can kind of see. Um, I'm not sure what happened when I was making these. They're not all this small. This is probably the smallest one. I don't know why I grabbed this one for the video, but yeah, um, these smell better than Bath and Body Works Japanese Cherry Blossom if you guys do love that fragrance. Perfect for upcoming spring as well or maybe even Valentine's Day for your girlfriend or any woman in your life, your mom. Um, okay, I don't know why I grabbed these two in front of me. Those ones are not um, discounted. I believe I discounted my mahogany teak wood. I only have very few of these left. I, I And again, these have been sitting on my shelf a while. They're not expired, but I just want to make room for my new um, stuff coming. These are perfect for a guy. These smell awesome. Exactly like Mahogany Teakwood. Very similar to the Bath & Body Works fragrance. I might bring these back in the future with color in them, but again, these were slow sellers, and I think it's because I didn't add any color to this one. So maybe if you like a more natural bar of soap where there's no color, go grab these. I also have cedar wood and apple sage that do not have color in my shop. They all smell amazing. Okay, another, there. I think there's a few more soaps that are on clearance. Just go look in my shop. Um, but yeah, another update I wanted to give you guys is my Witch's Brew soap. It's not called Witch's Brew anymore. It's now called Northern Lights. Oh my gosh, my light went off. Sorry about that, guys. But anyway, this one's called Northern Lights. Let me just turn that light back. Okay. As I was saying, here's my new label, Northern Lights. I decided to call it that is because it's black like a sky and it has kind of green and purple going through just like Northern Lights are. And I love my new labels. And if you guys didn't smell this one, 
seriously, this is one of the best and most popular soaps in my shop right now. This is not on clearance. Go and grab this one while you still can. When people buy, they buy a lot of these, so yeah, go grab some. And I did make a matching candle with my new Northern Lights sticker. And did I tell you guys, this smells exactly like zebra stripes gum. So fruity, like a fruit punch, but it's exactly like zebra stripes gum. Perfect for kids. Um, oh, these are nice, strong soy wax candles. And I did put some glitter on top. And I did stick some star stickers around. How cute are these? Um, and unfortunately, I'm not going to be having glass jars in my shop much longer. Once these are gone, they're gone. Um, I'm going to be having tin candles in my shop for multiple reasons. I'll get into that in a minute. Um, another candle that's not quite in my shop yet is my Japanese cherry blossom candles. I only have seven of these. I'm still waiting on some new stickers to come in the mail. I got some cute flower stickers for the outside of the jar. Um, I don't know why, but I'm obsessed with matching stickers to the fragrance now. Um, so that's that. Oh, these smell so good. And I did put some glitter on top. Very strong. All natural soy doesn't have any harmful paraffin wax in it. Um, a lot of people aren't aware that paraffin wax can cause cancer. Um, but yeah, look it up. You'll see all the information online, um, which is why I always use pure soy wax. Another bar I forgot to show you just a minute ago for my clearance collection. This is one of my cheaper bars. I think this is like $3 and something right now. Where can you find a handmade cold process soap made with all the like top ingredients like coconut oil, palm oil, um, pure silk, mm, castor oil. These lather amazing. These smell good, but the reason I'm discounting them is because there's major creases on the side and some of these, some of these smell really good, but some of the fragrances kind of morphed. Um, there's kind of a strange smell to it, in my opinion. Some of you may disagree, but I've had these a long time and I just want to make room. So, like $3 for a handmade soap. Seriously, go grab them. Kids love this one. I got some good feedback on this one. They're just not selling very fast for me. Um, so I won't be bringing back the Blue Raspberry Slushy fragrance anymore. Another one of my favorites is the mango sorbet. This isn't dis discounted because it smells absolutely amazing. This is selling slow too. And I don't know why, because it smells awesome. And last but not least, least another favorite of mine is the Midnight Love. Perfect for Valentine's Day. I am going to have some candles coming out in this fragrance as well as bath bomb powder. That's another new thing that's coming to my shop is bath bomb powder. It's going to come in these holographic Ziploc bags and it's going to be layered in different colors. And you can sprinkle as much as you want in your tub instead of feeling like you have to use a whole bath bomb at once. Um, a lot of people wanted more options for bath bombs. So I thought that bath bomb powder is going to be way easier for me to ship to you guys. You guys are going to have an easier time taking it to like vacations and hotels with you if you like using that in your big bathtubs. Um, I am so excited. Fortunately, I don't have any to show you right now because I'm still working on, it, working on it. But I do have these jumbo bath bombs in my shop right now. Um, I don't have too many left, but I'm not sure if I'm going to continue making jumbo bath bombs because I am bringing in that new bath bomb powder, which is easier for me to ship. So if you guys do love these, go grab them. This is cucumber melon and it smells amazing. So the last thing I want to share with you guys quick, I hope you, I hope you guys made it this far in the video. Hopefully this isn't boring, but I love sharing everything with you guys about my shop. Here are the new four ounce candles. Honestly, they aren't big. Oh, 
this one smells so good. This is going to be one of my new fragrances called Campfire. So, so good. There's kind of a hint of whiskey, um, smoke, kind of tobacco. It's a really kind of manly fragrance. And I will be offering these four ounces in a big sample pack with six different fragrances of four ounce tints inside. Whew. So take like, oh my gosh, why did I say that? Look forward to like these coming to my shop. Mm, I am so excited. Like I am like jumbling my words and speechless. Um, I do have boxes coming to fit all six of these. So when you order it, you're going to get it in a cute box. Perfect for gift giving. Who is not going to be excited to smell like six different fun fragrances coming to my shop? I am so excited. So, unfortunately, I only have one of these made so far. I still have five different fragrances to work on. I will also be bringing in some eight ounce tin sizes. So once you try the sample pack and you decide which ones you love the best, you can come back and order the larger size if you'd like. So, I think I said everything that I wanted. Um, sorry, this kind of got to be longer than I expected. I really appreciate all your orders that you guys been making. All of your nice feedback I've been getting in my Etsy shop. Please, 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 if you make an order, please leave your review on my site. That really helps customers decide what they like and if they would like something. So, thank you guys for watching. I feel like I have more to tell you, but I don't think I do. I'm just going to continue to smell my candles here. <laughs> Seriously, when I get new fragrances in the mail, I cannot stop smelling them. Does anybody else have that problem? So, I'm starting to ramble now. So, I hope you guys have an awesome day. I hope you guys go check out my clearance items and help support my small business. Thank you all who have. I would not be here without you guys. Have an awesome day. Um, please subscribe. Please follow me on Instagram. I'll post my link down below as well as my Facebook group page. Um, so yeah, see you guys there. See you guys next time. Bye.